Hi guys, it's Hani here. Welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome to a really fun cookie decorating tutorial. You guys have been asking for more ideas on how to make cookies that look like real food. And I really hope you like pasta because today we are making shrimp cookie pasta. Yes, you heard right. And if you remember two years ago, I showed you how to make uh, adorable fruit cookie salad. You can check it out on my YouTube channel. Link is in the description box. And as always, to make the cookies, I used my sugar cookie dough recipe. And to decorate, I am using fresh lemon royal icing. Here are the shapes we'll be using. This will be a snow pea. I used a round cutter to get this shape to make the tomato lemon slice and onion. I used a round cutter for the onion. I also used smaller cutter to cut out center. To make the pasta, I used the bow cutter. For the broccoli, this is, a, I believe this is a acorn from a, a fall set. And to make the shrimp, I used the cutter that I uh, shaped from the mini candy cane cutter using pliers. Starting with the broccoli, use edible marker to divide the cookie. And now we're gonna use light green, about 15 second consistency. Add some yellow and then with a needle tool, blend the yellow into the green and shape the icing while it's still wet. Use some dark green to give it more interest. And then we're going to let the stem crust for about five minutes or so. To make the broccoli florets, I'm going to divide the cookie into sections using piping consistency dark green royal icing. Now flood every other window with dark green. I accidentally flooded the window next to it, so don't make the same mistake. And then add a little bit of light green. Use your needle tool to shape and blend the icing. I'm going to let it crust and then we're going to continue add more icing and fill in all the sections. Once icing is crusted, you can add dots using piping consistency, dark green royal icing. Now we can start with the onion. Use dark purple for the outer perimeter and then we're going to flood it with white realizing 15 second consistency. Onion is probably the easiest one from this set. Now take a lighter shade of purple and pipe the circles like this. 
use your needle tool to smooth the ends if needed and then we're going to move on and make the tomato so we need to spread a thin layer of dark red royal icing onto the cookie and let that dry Now use same dark royal icing for the outside, for the outside, for the outline, <laughs> for the outside. Silly me. Now use lighter shade of red. Again, I'm using about 15 second consistency. Now we're going to flood it all. Now take some muted pink, by muted I mean I use some pink food coloring, I added some ivory to it to mute it down. And while the icing is still wet, shape it. You can also add some yellow in the center and blend it in now with yellow piping consistency make the seeds you don't have to make the seeds uniformed they can be smaller and bigger to make it even more realistic so that's the tomato now we're gonna make a lemon slice i always like to add some fresh lemon juice to my pasta salad So for the skin I'm using dark yellow, let that crust and now we're gonna start with lighter yellow, 15 second consistency and while light yellow is still wet we're going to use white royal icing to create segments. To make the snow peas, like I said before, I used a round cutter and we're going to start by piping medium sized dots with light green royal icing and then we're gonna have to let that dry. Now use dark green 15 second consistency royal icing for the outline and then followed immediately with 15 second consistency light green. Shake the cookie to smooth the icing and then with the needle tool carefully distribute the icing and also blend the darker edge into the lighter green like so. I'm going to let it crust and then we're going to finish the snow pea by adding the calyx using dark green royal icing. Use your needle tool to shape the icing while still wet. And snow peas are finished. Now it's time for the pasta. To make the pasta, I am using ivory royal icing in three shades. This is the lightest and I'm using 15 second consistency. Now take medium shade ivory, 15 second consistency as well. With a needle tool shape the icing.
Now with the darkest shade of ivory, make two lines like so and use your into tool to shape it. So now we're going to make the shrimp. To make the shrimp, we need to divide cookie into sections and I'm going to use three colors, light, salmon color, dark salmon color and white. So we're going to first do the light salmon, then add a little bit of white, blend it in and then try to do the line with dark salmon as close to the edge as you can. And all of these should be about 20 second consistency so you don't end up having cave-ins. Let that crust and then finish the sections between. With darker shade, make the tail, let the two sides crust and then add the middle. And now let's eat shrimp cookie pasta salad. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Be sure to let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Don't forget to like this video and don't forget to share it on social media. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, be sure to subscribe. And if you have a suggestion for a future cookie decorating tutorial, let me know in the comments. Thank you so much for watching guys and I will see you next time.